The semifinals concluded today and the final matchups are set to see who will play for a 2012 U.S. Youth Soccer Region 4 Championship tomorrow at Reach 11 Sports Complex in Phoenix, Arizona. Under-16 Boys West Coast FC is headed to the regional final after dispatching 2011 finalist Heat FC 96 SH of Nevada, formerly New Sport FC, 3-1. West Coast wasted no time enforcing their will as they reeled off three goals before the game was 20 minutes old. Ether Bustos put West Coast ahead just two minutes after the opening whistle, and Ivan Canales doubled the lead ten minutes later. Taylor Davidson made it 3-0 with a goal in the 19th minute before Blake D'Amato pulled one back for the Heat in the 42nd. That was all the scoring as neither team could find the net in the second half and West Coast moves on to play for a trip to South Carolina. This team's been together for a couple of years now, you know, and they've came from being getting relegated to coming all the way to the regional championship final in two years. You know, about eight weeks ago, we really started the hard preparation. You know, the guys were in the gym once a week. We've been training three times a week. You know, we've been playing games, playing in tournaments. So I think the boys are starting to peak at the right time. And today's game was was a tough game because Heat's a good team. But in the first half, I think we were just, we, we played probably the best we've played in the whole tournament. You know, we played amazingly well, you know. It's been really hard, all the games that we played. But our defense is really strong now. We've just gotten one goal against. And our defense is just been playing really good and but the other teams have been really good too. Arsenal FC Lucy of Southern California have won all five games of the tournament by one goal and will face West Coast FC in an all Cal South final after beating Westside Metros Galacticos of Oregon 1 0 in the semifinals. Carlos Chagola scored the game winner in the 43rd minute to send Arsenal into Sunday's championship game, which will be a rematch of the Cal South State final, which West Coast won 1 0. Under-17 girls Legends Breakaway of Southern California have already booked their trip to the national championships via winning the U.S. Youth Soccer National League, but they want to take the Region 4 championship with them as they head to the final thanks to a 4-0 victory over TSA 95 Red of Arizona. University of San Diego commit Kylie Sincox netted what proved to be the game winner in the 18th minute as the score remained 1-0 coming out of the break. In the second half, Breakaway pulled away with goals from Jordan Jasolva, Nicolette Martino, and Taylor Vargo. Central Valley Chili Peppers of Northern California not only earned a spot in the regional final with a 3-1 victory over Arsenal, Colorado, they also get to start making plans for the national championships as they will represent Region 4 thanks to Legends Breakaway already going as the National League representative. Colby Carson grabbed the early lead for Central Valley in the second minute to get things started and Jacqueline Locke doubled the lead in the 30th. Katie Cooper has pulled Arsenal back within a goal just before halftime, but Central Valley put the game away for good with Brianna Vassali's strike in stoppage time. Under 13 boys but not 99 gold of Arizona were eliminated in the 2011 semifinals by the eventual champion, but they took care of business this year to advance to the final with a 4-0 win versus Hawaii Rush 99 Nike. Adrian Argueta put Banat ahead in the seventh minute and teammates Dante Dario Reyes and Carlos Franco extended the lead to three before halftime. With solid defense protecting a three-goal lead, Reyes completed his brace in the 70th as Banat will play for the championship in 2012. Had 
United FC Gold 98 have claimed the 2012 Cal South State Championship and the Dallas Cup Trophy, and now will play for a top spot in Region 4 as they held on to a 1-0 lead to beat Washington Premier FC 98 Black. Kevin Diaz lifted United to victory with the game-winning strike in the 28th minute as the defense proved their worth in the shutout. The final will be a rematch from Pool B when United and Banat played to a 1-1 draw after both teams had already qualified for the elimination rounds. Despite dropping a 1-0 decision to LaRocca in the Utah State Championship, Sparty United 99 Premier will play for the Region 4 title after holding off Legends FC 99 of Southern California by a 1-0 score. Brianna Miller netted the winning goal early in the 13th minute, and the Sparta defense took care of the rest as they looked to avenge their loss from the state final. It will be a Utah State final rematch in the Under-12 Girls Regional Championship game as La Roca Premier PO of Utah prevailed in a penalty shootout after enduring a scoreless regulation in two overtime periods versus Northwest Nationals of Washington. It was really intense, um, but we didn't give up. Our defense played an amazing game and our center mids didn't give up either. And we tried to um, put one in, but we're still happy with the results and I think we played as hard as we possibly could. We're not crying. It's, it's tears of joy. La Roca were perfect from the spot to take a 5-3 advantage in the shootout to advance to the Region 4 Championship. Well, the final for us is a dream. Can you believe we're from Utah and we play Cal, Cal South? I mean, we're talking about legends. Our club is so much bigger right now. La Roca FC is, is getting the, the big club in, in our state, but still we can compare Utah with uh, California South. Tomorrow we play legends, in my opinion, the best soccer team in the nation. So we're, this is a dream, but I don't think we'll let I don't think we'll give it an easy game to them. We'll put the life and this chemistry is really hard to destroy. This is amazing. Um, we've never gotten this far. This is our first year and um, this just means a lot to our team and I think it means a lot to La Roca. Um, our coach has never been here before and so it's a great opportunity for everyone.